Next up, we're going to go and meet Nathan Wyburn. Now, Nathan Wyburn, you might have seen, he did a thing on Britain's Got Talent where he made Simon Cowell out of Marmite on toast. Mm. And it was sort of like thick and like too dark and like, ugh. but Marmite I love. Right. But um, hey! uh, Nathan has previously made portraits of Kate Moss using moss. I got it. Steps using his feet. Yes. And Reese Witherspoon. And then without her spoon. Good. Great. <laughs> Thanks. I was really proud of that. Uh, let's see what me. madness Nathan is up to now. So my name is artist Nathan Wyburn, and I'm so excited to be here at Student Pride. I'm a pop culture portrait artist known for maybe using unconventional materials, including food. So maybe we should find out what I'm going to be using for my artwork today. So I've decided I'm going to make some portraits of some of the special guests involved in the event this year. But I'm not going to use paints and pastels and all those traditional things. I'm actually going to be using some pizza. So here are all my pizza ingredients. I've got some cheese and olives and peppers. Tomato puree will be the key ingredient, I think. And obviously the pizza base. And I'm also going to be using some lipstick, so that might be a little bit of a hint as to maybe somebody that I'll be creating. And also I've mixed up some very thick coffee, not tea. That also might be another hint. So I'm really, really excited to get going and making these portraits. And fingers crossed, the people that I create love them. We're gonna go check in on Nathan, see how he's getting on with our pizzas. Nathan. Thank you so much both. I have had the most incredible day creating your portraits, Nick and Amy, in the most creative, tasty way. So I've actually made them on pizzas. Now this is definitely one of my favorite materials to use. There's Amy and da da da. There you are, Nick. So they're your portraits created on pizza. I know, Amy, you're a vegetarian, so I have kept it all vegetables, but it's actually mostly made up using the tomato puree, and then obviously some cheese there. You've got cheese for your hair, Amy. We've got olives, peppers, and I just think it looks really, really delicious. So hopefully you'll enjoy them when you indulge into them and have a little taste of each other's faces, I believe. And I've also decided to, because I'm a huge Drag Race fan, lipstick for the incredible Lawrence Cheney, winner of RuPaul's Drag Race. I think that's probably one of my favorite portraits I've done in a long time, and Lawrence absolutely loves it as well. So the lipstick for Lawrence Cheney, and of course, if I was creating tea or coffee, I wanted to answer the question, and I have made tea or coffee using coffee. And it smells absolutely incredible, and that's always one of the nicest thing about my work as well, is that the other senses get ignited as well, so the pizza portraits smell incredible. This smells incredible. Lawrence doesn't smell, I'm sure she's happy about that. But I'm really, really pleased. And thank you so much to Student Pride for having me as well. So I guess it's just back over to you guys to enjoy and eat each other's faces. Thank you. Wow. Wow, <laughs> mind blowing. Thank you so much, Nathan Wyburn. That like pretty much blew my mind. I mean, we've not actually looked at these in real life. I presume they've been Should cooked. Should we do it on three? Yep. One. Two, three. Oh, 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 oh Ooh, wow. there's a pepper. I look quite tasty, actually. Mine's fabulous. I look like I've been given Madonna's gappy mouth. Look. I really appreciate the eyelash detail, wow. I must say. Absolutely. Fabulous. Get it? <laughs> um, guys, thank you so much for watching this evening. Ha